For Comedy Hype News, I'm Symphony Thompson. Well, it looks like Cat Williams' viral interview on Club Shay Shay still has everyone talking and we're still dealing with the after effects. Ever since Cat publicly accused Cedric the Entertainer of stealing one of his jokes and using it for the original Kings of Comedy, fans online have took it upon themselves to see if Cat's accusations has any merit. Not only that, but fans are digging up even more footage of comedians telling similar stories on the jokes that were stolen from them. One video that has begun to resurface comes from the Mike and Donnie show back in 2019. It features comedian Mark Curry publicly accusing Steve Harvey of stealing one of his jokes. During that same interview, Curry would admit that he confronted Harvey about stealing his material at the Def Jam 25th reunion back in 2017. One user on TikTok, It's the Shark, shared a clip from the Def Jam 25 Netflix special. The clip comes from the end of the special where all the comedians were invited on stage. There, Curry can be seen talking to Steve Harvey. Now, it's obviously unclear what was said between the two of them, but according to Curry's 2019 interview, this is where he decided to talk to Harvey about taking one of his jokes. Several social media users were shocked to find out the conversation took place live on Netflix and would hop in the comments to show their support to Curry. One user would write, The way Steve Harvey doesn't even look at Mark is proof that everything he's saying is valid. Another user would write, a Mark knew he would probably never be in the same place as him at the same time again. Respect to him. Another user, JB Smooth, heard it. Lastly, another user would chime in and say, Dave Chappelle narrating this is epic. Now, Kat's interview would reference Harvey still in Mark Curry style and sitcom format. Throughout the years, Harvey has rubbed several stand-up comedians from the Def Jam era the wrong way, and this is just another example why. Back in 2019, Mark Curry had this to say about Steve Harvey stealing his material. Well, Steve stole my material on his show, so I had a beef on that. He did all my Halloween material one Halloween. I'm watching that, and I know he didn't think of it. You know, this, this is true stuff that really happened to me. Uh -huh. And so my thing is, you don't have to do that, homeboy. Right. So, you know, motherfucker, you made enough money, bitch ass. You know, what, why are you on my material? Right. You know, what's that about? The new video evidence has given fans more reasons to support Kat and Mark Curry after the two have just shared that they'll be going on tour together. Curry is usually active on his social media and in addition to announcing his tour dates with Kat, he would share a video that some would assume could be a subliminal response to Harvey. Earlier last week, Curry would post, We are so addicted to coffee. We first get our coffee, we sit down there. Good. We like our coffee, don't we? Just love our coffee. We go crazy over coffee. Isn't that crazy? As soon as you get that coffee, you're like a... Mm. You just sit here all by yourself. Remember, you used to, you used to want to talk to people. Now, with your coffee, you don't need nobody. Got my friend here. I don't need nobody. What are you doing? What? Coffee has become your best friend. You just, that's your friend. Look, you, just, you don't drop nothing. Mm. You're more sure when you sit it down, it's stable. You don't even sit it down. You ever notice that? You don't set that coffee down. You hold that the whole time. Make sure ain't nobody coming to get your coffee. This is your new friend. Followers of Curry were abused by the post with one user even saying, Curry said nothing and everything at the same time. Another Instagram user would write, make sure ain't nobody coming to get your coffee says it all. Another would chime in, we are here for the tea and he's talking about the coffee. Well played, Mr. Curry. But what do you guys think of Mark Curry confronting Steve Harvey at the Def Jam 25 reunion? What do you think of Curry's resurfaced claims and subliminal response? Let us know in the comments below. Stay up to date with the latest news and comedy by subscribing here to our YouTube channel. Follow Comedy Hype across all social media and look out for original content on our new streaming service at ComedyHype.com. For Comedy Hype News, I'm Symphony Thompson. Oh, <laughs> you feeling my shirt? <laughs> well, I'll tell you where I got it from, but it's a bit of a secret. Nah, it's the hype market. Thehypemarket.com.
This is where I get all my exclusive pieces from black owned to cool owned brands. Every brand has a story and you get a chance to figure out who and what you're spending your money on. I mean, they even have spaces for you to use. I, 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 come here. They even have tickets for events and exclusive joints just like this. Oh, now if you excuse me, they just dropped some new art and I think it's time for me to add to my collection.